Hi everybody, welcome to Vickyville. I hope you are having a wonderful day. I am kind of under the weather. The weather, like my allergies are acting up, so I've been a little bit like meh. But I decided that I would come on here because I really want to make more videos. It's my favorite platform. I love YouTube. So I decided that I was going to share my favorite subscription that I have every month, which is Mommy Laid Little Bits Box, and it is so cute. And recently she shared how she stores all of her, uh, you know, previous things that come in the subscription box. And I was just keeping all of my, my boxes as they fall in the box that they come in. But then you really like, you get so much product every month that you want to use it in your other planners as well. So I implemented what she shared and every month you get like a little zipper pouch or like a little, um, you know, little pouch like this. And so what I did was like, these are all of the stickers that have come. And I started, I think her first box was November and I haven't missed one. So they're all in here. And as you can see, I have quite the stack there. And then these were all the little stamps that have come in each. I'll go ahead and share that with you really fast because they're so cute. And you could definitely use this in all of your other planners as well. So here's all the little stamps that I've had so far in all the other boxes. And also there's a whole bunch of stencils as well. And so it's really nice to have them at your fingertips in these pouches because a lot of times I like to go to like Starbucks or if I meet up with like a friend and we you know plan together. So it's nice to have it all like that. And then this is all the paper that has come in because you also get some paper and I also have like some of the boxes have like little prompts on the postcard and I like I like following the prompts and then adding them into like my planner so I think that's really cute and then also there's been some bookmarks in the past and these are all the different papers that you've received in your awesome box and so these are all the papers that I haven't used and like I can even use this for other things I'm obsessed with mommy late I love just the colors the kawaii-ness it's so cute and yeah so these are all you know I could use it for um card making for scrapbooking for all kinds of things it's very versatile and I love it and I'm like why am I hiding all my products sometimes and I don't know if you're like me but I am terrible about wanting to keep everything that I love and not use it and then what happens is I don't use it and then it becomes like you know something's always new and I want that too so I'm like I'm not doing that this year I am using it and I'm gonna see it for what it is and it's beautiful and why would I save it when I could use it and have fun with it and a lot of times she'll also throw in some other things like washi and uh, this also ephemera. You get ephemera in each in each box. Uh, some of the times you've got some post-it notes. Those are cute. Uh, you also sometimes will get a pen. That's so cute. And you get sometimes like I said they're all different but sometimes you'll get a charm I love all the charms you know me I love to like have decorations for all my things so I thought those were so cute and also I love this this is the second like washi um trimmer that we've gotten in one of our boxes and you know when you're on your planner you don't need scissors you just put this and you can just trim your washi and it's like a clean cut on the washi and I think it's just so cute so yeah if you're looking for a subscription that's affordable I think it's like I want to say it's $40 it might be a little less it might be a little more I can't remember <laughs> but uh yeah it's really fun yeah here's these were I think this was the first box and these were 
so cute. Like we've got this before, like a little clip. And then this was the first, and these were like little highlighters in the first box. And then these are some of the washies that we've received in the box. Ah! Oh my goodness. So it is so cute. And I, I, like I said, I just, I love, I love seeing it and playing with my little um, albums. And I think I made some videos uh, before about like sharing all of them, but like I put this in a pouch and these are my planners that I have received so far. It's like a little TN. And then my very first one I gave to my niece Coco because she like, she's like me and she loves little small things. <laughs> so yeah I just I love it I love it I love it I love getting it in the mail I'm like so excited to see it and whenever mommy lay like posts like the video of what it's gonna be I try not to look because I, I totally want to be surprised okay so that brings me to this month's box maybe not this month because we're in April now but uh this is March March's box I believe and it is so cute. And so let me go ahead and share with you what we got. So this month's planner is a little bigger. And I I think that is awesome as well. I, I really I really like every size. I'm not one to like have a favorite. You know my main planner is the ring binder from Erin Condren. I just it fits for me. I you know it's it's good. Sometimes I go for the um horizontal, sometimes I go for the vertical. What I love about these uh, bullet journals is that you can make them however you want. You could, you know, set it up however it is. You might, some of mine are like, I will do like my Bible studies on them. Some of them, some, one of them is a gratitude journal. Some of them is, um, I want to use the TN one that I showed you this one. I think I might use it for like, uh, my little, like I was saying, Coraline, she just had a party and I was thinking, I, I'm going to use that. That's so cute. So kawaii for like her party. It was like a little Coraline, uh, the, the movie theme party. And I thought that would be so cute to start it off and then just like add whenever I take pictures with her and stuff. So she's adorable. But yeah, so that, this is um, so cute. I love it. And, you know, you can write your name there and then paper I was watching her video where she went live and she was talking about all the different and like I know how hard it is to find this paper because I remember when we were um when Tina and I were working with wandering planners I love wandering planners uh if you know me from there hi yeah I'm still just not traveling anymore but I'm still a planner nerd and planner girl and planner obsessed and scrapbook obsessed and everything so love scrapbook expo it's my jam i love it all but um yeah i know how hard it is to find this amazing paper and i do like every paper that she's given us so i guess i'm just i just love it all i i can see the value in all of it and i know how much work goes into trying to get all this product and time and you know all those things so i really love that this is so much fun and it just speaks to my little crafty heart so then we got a washi in this month and this looks like it is cherry blossom so that's so pretty i don't know if you could see with that so pretty oh yeah and then even the the planner has cherry blossoms on there as well so cute okay and then ooh, we got not a zipper pouch but one of these um pouches like that Okay, but before I go further, let me just see. We got a charm to hang from the planner. So yay, I love that. That's my fave. Ooh, and then what is this? How cute. Like she always throws in a little added piece. Like, like I said before, it was that washi cutter or there was like a washi stand one time. And I love that. And I think this is the added and it's a little tote bag perfect to hold how cute to just take it with you look at how perfect it fits when you you know when you want to go and just work 
on this planner and you have all the tools necessary right at your fingertips. So that'd be so cute. And then you could even like get some um, fab fabric markers and color it in if you want, or you could add, um, you know, glitter to it, whatever. You could totally jazz this up as well. So I think that'd be so cute. I love it. I love it. I love it. Okay. So that is the bomb. Okay. Let's go ahead and open this little pouch. Did I show you that you got this cherry blossom? It doesn't look like it. You got a pen. How cute is that? The little charm and the little little jewels in there. That is so fun. Or little sequins. I'm sorry, jewels. But how cute is that? I love it. And it's one of the. Ooh, it's one of those nice felt tip pens as well. Let's see how it how it writes. a fine tip pen. So that's so cute. I love it. And my friend Tina just got me this for my birthday this year. So isn't that cute? She's my favorite princess of Cinderella. I love um I love her. She's so awesome. Okay. What's your favorite? who is your favorite princess? Mine is definitely Cinderella. But I probably my second would be Merida from um oh my gosh brave i just lost my brain or also i love jasmine from aladdin so those are probably my top three who are your favorites let me know in the comments below okay so now i'm opening the pouch and like i said we get like this little what the contents of the box are going to be so this was march <laughs> okay and then right here there's journaling prompts and i always love answering just gives me like, you know, on some of those pages where I don't know what I want to, what I want to write about, or I'm just one day I'm kind of like, I'm not, you know, quite sure. You know, those days when you're just like, what am I going to do? I think this is very helpful. So mommy lay, if you're watching this, keep doing this. I love it. Okay. And then, oh, how cute. Okay. So here is the sticker pack and probably like this would be the ephemera as well. Yeah. Yes. So let me go ahead and open those and show you how fun this is. So yeah, they're all stickers as well, I believe. So how cute with the cherry blossom. It's so feminine and pretty. You can see. Look at that. Wow. I cannot wait to use this. I had been waiting. I want I I've, I got this box a few weekends ago, but I've just been so busy and I haven't used it yet because I wanted to make a video with it. See, I'm trying to cover, <laughs> like for some reason, my shirt keeps on shifting over and I have to get on my nerves. Okay, sorry. I, I get sidetracked. Oh, and look at how cute this one is. Oh my gosh. I almost want to put this like on my Stanley cup. And then... This one says gloom, so that's super cute. And then I love having these in my planner for like, you could keep it open for dates, you could pick a date or something like that. And then here is, ooh, this is really awesome. I'm, I'm, I'm looking at it for the first time right now as we're looking. I had kind of opened it, like I said, a few weekends ago, but I forgot. <laughs> so this is so cute. So it has the months. And then it has the actual number dates. And I think that is, that's just brilliant. I love that because I do date my planner every single day and that's really nice. I love it. Okay. Then you get this sticker pack and let me go ahead and open that up and show you these stickers. I'll go by quickly. Oh, these are nice. These are nice to put in the planner, kind of like washi stickers. How cute is that? I love the cherry blossom theme. That is so cute. And the mint with the pink is so pretty. And then, oh, these are, I love this. These are the days, like Monday through Sunday. And I always do that for my planner as well. Just some more cherry blossom stickers with the pink, like washi 
look and then here is gosh you get so much i'm telling you guys there's so many in the sticker sheets in this it's so cute let's go to the bar and then more stickers More stickers and then here's more um, like Monday Tuesday reminders and the numbers as well so that is adorable in the same theme colored and all that so I love that then you get stencils and I really do I've never I love stencils but I always they're not my first thing that I grab for but since I get this box I've really been trying to use um the stencils that come in the box on the planner pages and i love it i'm like why haven't i been doing this more so here looks like it's like a cursive alphabet so that's cute for a background and then this just looks kind of like it's like a background fun and then here is kind of like where you could do the um the dot line the rainbow and then you can make personalize the little um, planner boxes. So that is so, so cute. And last but not least, you get a pack of paper. So let me just go through that really fast and show you how cute this is. Cause oh my gosh, it is just adorable. So this is what you're gonna get in this pack. We're going by how cute is that cherry blossom vellum that has kind of like a pink on it I'm sure that my showing you isn't doing it justice but it's so pretty you guys and then this is kind of like a leopard pink and brown you know leopard is my favorite color <laughs> that is so cute and then this is double-sided so on one side is these cute little cherry blossom bunnies and then on this side is a stripe that kind of gives that Compliment to um, the front page and then here is the other this is what an ice cream how cute is that a little cherry blossom and a little bear and then on the back you have this fun mint little um, theme or plaid and you get two sheets of that and then last oh, the, oh how cute the little bear with the cherry blossom so cute and then on the back you get that pink um plaid or green as well so i'm telling you guys i love this it is so fun so cute i can't wait to set it up and if you want to see me set it up and how i um set up for the month or however long because sometimes like i said i it goes in for because uh, my planner my planner i keep for my daily and i keep that organized mommy lays planner i use it for other things like i said one of them is for like my Bible journaling, you know, one I want to use as a memory keeper, stuff like that. So, but this one I'll set it up and I will share it with you if you want to see how I do set it up for the month or when I'm done with it. So this was a fun box. This is March. I'm not sure if she sells out every month, but if you're interested, uh, go ahead and uh, find her on Instagram or on YouTube. She does have a... a YouTube channel and just let her know that your girl Vickyville sent you to her and I hope that that blends two fun rad people all over in love with mommy lay and little bits box and I anyways thank you guys for being here I love you and I hope you have a wonderful day and I hope you know how much your girl Vickyville loves you remember to always keep it crafty your girl Vickyville loves you